put the screwdriver just here to hold the clutch. Hi guys and welcome back to Mini Bike Store video blog. In today's video I'm gonna show you how to replace a clutch in the uh, 49cc 9 horsepower engine which is in the NRG50 short bike from Nitro Motors. This is a replica of KTM engine. So uh, if you own KTM, you can also follow this video step by step how to replace the clutch. So uh, I will show you how to do it without any special tools. So you can do it yourself at home. So first we need to drain the uh, oil from the gearbox. This is the screw you we have to remove it and uh, drain the oil. Make sure you have the bucket for the oil. So let the oil drop into the bucket. We can also remove the bolt here on the top. We have to loosen all these bolts here, this one here, so loosen all these two, four, six bolts. And actually remove all these bolts. So we have now removed all the bolts which hold the cover into the engine. Now we can open the cover a little bit. Just don't damage the gasket. So be very careful. You can do it like this. See now the oil is coming out of the gearbox. So wait. Do not damage the gasket. So we have the gearbox now open and we have to remove the clutch. To do so we have to unscrew this uh, nut here which holds the clutch. Uh, to do so you need a spanner number 16. Put the screwdriver just here to hold the clutch. And unscrew the clutch. Remove the nut. Now you have to pull the clutch out. So after you remove the nut from the crankshaft, you have to pull out the clutch, which can be very difficult. There are special pullers you can buy uh, online, but uh, here I have one which I made myself. It's just a good quality washer. Uh, we have drilled two holes here for the bolt to hold the clutch. So you install the washer just like this. There are two little holes here in the clutch. And the second one. Now I have a puller like this in my garage, which I will be using here.
as you can see it's not easy and here it is the clutch is out see the clutch is holding really well it's pretty hard to remove it but you can simply make the puller like this like I made it just of a simple uh, washer and this is a standard puller you can get in the shop or you, you may have one of them so so we have removed the clutch now and uh, we will install the new one so here it is, it is the new one. I won't actually install the new one because this one is actually almost brand new. The bike was only used for a few hours. So I will install back this clutch, the old one. So it's a reverse procedure. You have to place the clutch in place like this. Use the spanner like this, place it, and you can just hit it a few times so it will sit well in position. So when you have done that, just insert the nut. Next, put the screwdriver just here in the hole to hold it. And with spanner number 16, just tie the nut well. like this now you have to install the cover of the gearbox so here we have the cover so first place the gasket so actually place the gasket here the bolt through it to make sure the gasket will be in position Tight two bolts, just a little bit. Now insert the rest of the bolts. Just make sure the gasket is properly inserted. And now tight all four bolts well. Let's insert this bolt here, which you can drain the oil from the gearbox. Next, top up oil.
So this is how you replace the clutch in the 4090T uh, two-stroke kickstart engines. This is a copy of the KTM. So in both in original KTMs or in the copy ones like the NRG50 uh, from Nitro Motors, uh, this is the uh, way how you replace the clutch yourself at home. So thanks guys for watching this quick video. If you like it, put the thumbs up. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you like the bikes, you can purchase them from our website. The link to our shop is in the description. See you in the next video.